Hi, I'm Shane. And I'm Melody, and today we are making some rich and creamy homemade mashed potatoes. That's right, it's one of my absolute favorites. And, and as opposed to the instant mashed potatoes, we're gonna show you step by step on how you can get even more flavor out of this beautiful red potato than you've ever imagined as the perfect side dish for pretty much any meal. And it's easier than you might think. That's a lot easier. Mm -hmm. So what I'm gonna do right now to get started is I'm gonna start cutting these potatoes up while the lovely Melody here takes over and tells you a little bit about what we're gonna be doing in the process. So spice-wise and everything, it's pretty simple. Uh, well, first off, okay, this is just water, plain old water. If you want to salt it to taste, that's completely fine as well. And then we're just gonna boil that bad boy up and get ready for everything else. Parmesan cheese, of course. Anything with Parmesan cheese, I think it's just a little bit better. Uh, anything with cheese, period, is so much better. <laughs> That's the Italian coming out. Yeah, it totally is. Uh, butter and cream cheese as well. That might be something that maybe you're not used to, but it's not just for baking, everybody, or putting on bagels. Mm. And cream cheese is good in everything, too. I would agree. <laughs> I love all the things that make my hips bigger. <laughs> so do I. Okay, anyway, and then later after we're all done, we're gonna, so we have a little salt and pepper mixture that we're gonna do to taste. So I'm gonna be putting this in here, like I said, just straight water. We are making enough for a full family, so that's nice. Mm -hmm. And I'm hungry, so that works out nicely. So now I'm gonna turn around and put these on the stove on a high temperature until they start boiling. And I'm gonna boil them for about 20 minutes or so. We'll show you exactly how to tell how your potatoes are thoroughly cooked in just a little bit whenever they're about ready. It should take about 20 minutes, like I said. Um, and then we'll show you how to finish up these amazing homemade mashed potatoes. I think it's ready. <laughs> it's time for us to pull those potatoes off of the stove and uh, check to make sure that they're cooked all the way through and I'll show you exactly how to do that in just mm -hmm. a second. Starches are my favorite, oh, so I was, looking, done. I was definitely looking forward to this. Mm -hmm. So I wouldn't recommend setting your pan down on any other kind of a countertop. We can do it on this one because it's granite, but if you have a wooden countertop or something, make sure that you have a mat underneath it. Mm -hmm. Now I can tell just by looking at these potatoes definitely done. that they're definitely done, but one way that you can also check is the fork test. Um, stick your fork in your potato, and if the potato falls right off, then that's what we're looking for right there. So I'm going to strain these bad boys out, and then I'm going to let Melody take over. Indeed. Um, let the girl get a little control, will you? Oh, oh yeah. Okay. I'm going to leave it sitting in the pan so we're not dripping across, but Fine. I'm going to go ahead and scoot this over to you. I like if it. If you want to take that one off. And... I am all about it. I'm kind of excited for these potatoes. Is that sad? No, it's kind of your thing. Really like you like potatoes. starches. So just keep mixing it until it's all incorporated. You want to mix in that cheese and everything, but if you like it a little lumpy, just do it a little bit less. While mixing, just add salt and pepper to taste. All right, this is looking pretty good. I think it's about done. I think it's about time. I think That's... I want some of these mashed potatoes. Let's go ahead and see how those bad boys look. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yeah. I am telling you right now. Mm-hmm. Here, take that, will you? Oh, I will, gladly. <laughs> no licking the bowl quite yet. Oh, come on. <laughs> I almost thought, I, th I literally thought you were gonna I'll take a little lick out of it. Mmm, as I slop all over, I'll go ahead and clean that up. Yeah. I do like me some potatoes. Those look great. Mm-hmm. I'll let you have that. <laughs> All right, now, as we've discussed before, we like to uh, oh my God. make everything look presentable. So as a garnish mm. for this one, we're gonna use a little bit of the same cheese that we used inside of it, just to sprinkle on top, like so. I don't think you can go wrong with Parmesan. Mm. And there you have it, creamy homemade mashed potatoes. <laughs> 